Hey, what's going on guys? In this video, I'd like to share the best solo project I've got so far uh, regarding web scraping. And this is the Rightmost Scraper powered by Flask web application that allows to select properties uh, by the given parameters, just like they do it on Rightmove itself. So we just go to the Rightmove and say, uh, enter a UK specific postcode here and just go in and click for sale and let's let's have the properties within one mile and from a hundred thousands to say five hundred thousands of pounds and i just click find properties here it will return the results uh of the pro all the properties uh within the given area basically and here uh we have up to uh, 15 pages so if you just go to uh, my app and uh, specify absolutely the same parameters so I say CR06QG here and it will now upload the rate most specific uh, code uh, which is absolutely essential to get uh, the desired properties and also we need to specify uh, within one mile area and the price range from a hundred thousands up to five hundred thousands like this and I just click the scrape button and now the scraper is, uh, is has just started working in the background and as you can see here the data is being appended dynamically and rendered to this using this jQuery data tables plugin and it's it takes the data from the specific API endpoint that is uh, that it keeps track of the data being scraped and when the scraper is finished actually it actually gives us uh, uh, all the parameters being used during the scraping pro process and now we can simply just download the CSV and have a look what we got there okay so uh, just click OK here and this is this results CSV file of of this great database because it's quite pretty a lot of here lo lots of stuff here and this app uses scrapey framework in order to make asynchronous requests which makes it really fast and you know like pretty reliable basically so uh, I, will, I already have uh, two clients that were absolutely happy with this App. So uh, what I want to say uh, by this to you guys, so what, what you can learn out of this. So making web scrapers itself is really cool, but when they are powered by some sort of a, uh, nice and cute web user interface, uh, it's really more convenient for the clients. So the clients like this kind of stuff and this definitely costs, costs more uh, compared to the bare scraper itself. So I hope it makes some sense and I hope you learned something interesting out of this video. So until next time and take care.